Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2. We've just thrilled as you do remind last time. I got null killed. Yeah, no, that's not a good thing. I should not yay that. Uh, now we're gonna go and find a new big alien. Ah, uh, yes. Here we go. Uh, once again, I didn't actually look at the list of what is defending this place, but because we are bringing in female and Pryosh, I don't think that's gonna be an issue. Now, is it? No. No, you are not Infi or Mel. Ooh, apparently Stacy wants to come along. Well, Magus, you are not coming along. Not yet. I am. Pryosh is. And. Oh, Sky is already listed. And Nuke is. Nuke, you are going to bring. The Frostbomb, of course. You are already set up with the meat suit, which is great to hear. Does that mean I have two meat suits? Do we for some reason have multiple meat suits? No, we don't. Okay. Infi, why are you not wearing your spider suit? Oh, wait, I know. There, there has been some uh, missions where we had you with different things. Uh, what gun were you using? Oh right, you were using the one that's currently in Jack's possession, I assume. And... Let's see, you can also bring the Fusion Axe? Since I think someone else must be using the other swords. You're using Athena, as is to be expected, that is 100% approved weapon for you, and... Uh, you are also supposed to bring talent rounds. Right. Excellent. That's Infi set up. Sky, you should probably be absolutely fine with your current options, yes. I could I guess I could give you Doomstone. Since no one else is using it. And uh, Infi actually I do need to give you this. It's a mobility increase. Yes. Run far. Kill all. Okay, you can apparently upgrade something. Uh, I should probably give you the Warlock. Unless Mel is using the Warlock, in which case you can't have the Warlock. Because Mel will be using the Warlock. Yeah, that does, that does look to be the case. Oh, I have two power Shadow Keepers as well. Why, why are these doubled? I don't understand. I could upgrade that. This is, this is a pretty good weapon. I could give it some extra oomph. Uh, and I'll give you armor piercing rounds? No, I'll give you Talon. Talon is pretty good for you because you do get close and you do have the triple shot thing. Which can be really pretty damn handy. Uh, superior hair trigger? Uh, sure, why not? And an advanced repeater? Or advanced auto loader. Advanced auto loader because things require reloading with this weapon. For reasons unknown to me. It's indeed in reasons that I can't fully comprehend. Or understand for that matter. Uh, this has all the upgrades it needs, right? Yeah. That's fine. And uh, I am fine, I guess. Uh, what does my Kremlin have? Dry Ash and Blinding. I guess I can take Superior Blinding. I don't know what the purpose of it is. But I can take it. There's probably better things out there. But this is where we stand. And day four. I have been playing too much Vermintide too, if there is such a thing. But I don't believe there really is. Tipped us to an alien facility apparently conducting research tied to the Avatar project. We're moving in to take out the site and do whatever we can to slow their progress. Approach the designated target position and place the X4 charges. Then move to the evac point for immediate extraction. Once you're clear, we'll make sure that facility is out of commission for good. Excellent. That sounds quite a lot like a plan. And sometimes I do like plants, and 
this might be one of those times. Because last time I did not have a plan, which is why we ended up losing null. This is also the part where I'm just, I was just dumb about it. Okay. Let's take a look. This is the edge of the map. This is the edge of the map. The map doesn't go far that way either. So this is the edge of the map. Okay. Uh, metal. Uh, there's a tree over there. Got it covered. Take cover behind it. We'll see what you can see from there. No immediate eyes on anything. Right. Infi. There is a stone over there. Go check it out. See what you can see. I would love that jump. Okay, there's some bastards over there. Okay, Pryosh, go take a closer look at those bastards. And everyone else, I guess, must follow suit. Affirmative. Uh, Sky, that's cover. On you it. can get in that cover. And I will just uh, f f run along below, I guess. Or do I want to go behind the tree as well? I think I will leave Mel into cover. I mean, into concealment for uh, pulling the leader this time. And we will uh, destroy this group before we find the leader. We are now looking at the Viper Overlord, so that's fun. Um, apparently, you can't see them from over here. On my way. So let's get a little bit closer. Uh, do I take... I need take the guaranteed kill. One less bastard is one less bastard. I want death from above the trigger, but I don't know if this helps right now. Oh, it does. Cool. Okay, I don't know. Infi is still in concealment, right? I think we should still have three hidden people. Hostile target down. No, Infi is not hidden. In that case, this should be fine. I say. Impressed yet? Infi, I'm always impressed with you. All right, uh, Brioche, let's get you behind that pillar of bones. Did you find the leader? No. But you did find two turrets. That's for Sky to handle next turn, I guess. All right, and Mel, you're gonna run behind those trees over there. Let's hope there isn't any sudden secret enemies. Even within these crevices, crevices. I believe this would be Subject Gamma. Fallen created a Viper King. Just what we needed. All right, we have found the Viper King. On the move. Did I leave you with a rocket launcher? Yes, I did. Oops. I imagine I could have done something smarter. Okay, I'm gonna move uh, Infi over here. And we're already gonna prepare an overmatch. Just in case. Yes, that. Oh. Okay. That's fine. This is the shot we've been waiting for. Take that thing down before it has a chance to run. Okay, I think we might have to do this the old fashioned way. Which is sending the infiltrators. I'm spotted. You don't have fanfire yet. I think that's fine. You should still be able to survive without it. 
Okay, I'm pretty far away from this entire situation, so here's my plan. I'm going to take out the turrets with Sky, and uh, that is my entire plan for Sky and myself. Because Sky won't automatically have a second shot, so I will give her the second shot. She needs to destroy the turret. And luckily for us, the Viper doesn't actually see the two of us, so we can just uh, take care of that situation. It's dead. It has to be dead. All right. Uh, then I need Pryosh to move in. I've been spotted. Alright, you do just wait while I try and drop a frost bomb on that bush. Oh, fushed. And that's not the best now, is it? Oh, throw axe is free, by the way. It's free action, so let's do it. It doesn't count towards the whole bloody mess. Oh! Well, that went quicker than I expected. Oh, well, yes, of course, this happened. Double blade storm. Well, a single blade storm was enough, really. Target neutralized. King is down. Good work, people. It's over. Commander, that's the last of them. Three botched science experiments. Three alien rulers down for the count. At the very least, we know Valen is still out there somewhere, and we picked up some new gear in the process. Not a bad haul, considering. Menace one five, you're near the target position. Okay, take a look. Heading out. If it's a tra death trap. Who knows how long they've been keeping these storage units running down here? If it's a death trap, we can use order. nuke to give an extraction. But apparently it's not a death, enough of a death trap. Okay. So I want to... Moving to position. Bring everyone in for extraction over... In the middle of this place, I think? Like here is actually fine because... Uh, Pryosh and... Mel run super fast. So, yeah, I can get over there, but yeah, I think that sounds good. So just uh, activate the X4. Menace 1-5, status confirmed. X4 charges are armed. Move to the extraction point for immediate evac. And we'll build over there, around the X. We'll pick up the eggs to come with us, because those are good eggs, those look like they could make an omelette. If not, 12 omelettes. Already there. I'm trusting you here. Go, go, go. By the way, it sounds like plenty of noms. Out. That's what I like to hear. Seems doable. Let's get out of here. I'm going. Now, this was a nice and easy mission. Like, I wish the uh, last one would have gone that well. This is what I get on, for not bringing an infiltrator, I guess. Or not any two duos at all. And a level 2 robot. So yeah, there was a lot of things I could have done better last time. I love that we have the bone structure behind us in this picture. Yes. Resist the sinos. It's time to take the earth back. Or take Earth back. I left five aliens somewhere. I don't really care. We didn't find them. We didn't need them. So let them be. Despite the destruction left in their wake, XCOM refuses to let go of the ways of the old world. They will continue their wanton and reckless crimes until the entire world burns around them. We are grateful to the Elm. 
Yes, we are grateful to the elders for whatever the fuck they did this time. Uh, here's the plan now. I will have to start now, doing the shadow <laughs> chamber stuff. As soon as we have looked at the Viper King corpse. We should begin an autopsy as soon as possible. By following her own research notes, it is my hope that we will uncover the true purpose of her work. With the alien facility destroyed, their efforts to develop the Avatar project will likely suffer a substantial decline, at least for the time being. Excellent work, Commander. I think I could just destroy these as well. These aren't like... They have no defenses now. I could literally just in, send in Brioche, she could just destroy it and leave. Like, I wouldn't even have to send any, fr any backup at all. It's really that bad of a situation, isn't it? Avenger plotting new the aliens forms. don't stand a chance. Though I would be a lot happier with a belly full of alloys. Well, not a belly full, let's. Well, my ship's belly should be full of alloys. Some of this research can only further our advances, Commander. Sustaining sphere. Ah, yes, that's that thing. I don't really care. I want the Viper King though. It had been years since I conducted my last autopsy. I found the process returned to me quite naturally. This subject was perhaps less intimidating because of its similarities to varying reptile species found naturally on Earth. Because of extensive cytogenetic modifications to the subject's chromosomes, this could very well be the only male variant in the entire species. She says that actually all she did was chop off her tits. Apparently my predecessor was something but, of a Oh god, that's transphobic, isn't it? No, I, I guess I should respect the uh, Viper King's new gender. I'm sorry. Valen helped in the Viper King's transition and I'm just being a dick about it. <sighs> well... I do apologize for that remark. Oh well, uh, let's get back to it. You, you got money. Yes, I get it. Against the aliens over the past month has been significant, Commander. But there is still room to improve if we are going to eliminate the alien threat. We continue to progress oh, we... in the campaign against huh? the elders. Okay, no, that, apparently I did not. Oh, I did have this. As a result. But uh, let's replace it with level 2 then. I need these, I can't remove these. I don't need this anymore. Uh, so I can do stuff like this. So let's increase the mill recover as well. Might as well. I will pass along your order. Thank you. Alright, what did we need now? We need alloys, that's what we need. Was a success, Commander. Despite okay. an extensive study of Dr. Valen's research reports, I have yet to discover how she came to acquire such an impressive understanding of the processes involved in the editing and manipulation of alien genetic material. She was smart. Ooh. Uh, no, that's completely useless. There's absolutely no reason for me to do that at all. Oh, what does the sector pop record I've been give told, me? Our troops took to calling this large robotic unit a sectopod, under the initial assumption that it was being controlled by a sectoid pilot. On closer inspection, we can see that is not the case. Not unlike the mechanized advent units, which were likely derived from the sectopod itself, this machine seems to be entirely autonomous. Good to know. I, I want to break down everything. And then we can start doing the shadow chamber things. I promise we will actually finish the game if I don't fuck things up massively. Which you know I might do, I'm me. Yay! The aliens are not really having a lot of I'm fun with the... Like with that, are they? 
No. Ooh. It's a new mount. Uh, Oli, you are currently... Oh wait, no, I wanted to send Sky off on, on this, didn't I? Uh, I don't want Sky to get wounded, so... Ho Song, have fun. You had been on a mission before, have you, Ho Song? The answer is probably no, because I don't remember who of the scientists I have ever sent on a mission. Ooh, yeah. Drive people insane. That's Another good fun. Step forward in our research. Central claims Gremlin Mark Free. Ooh. Despite Ooh. a lot of speculation, there was no pilot to be found once we pried it open. Presumably, the name Chrysalid derives from assumptions made previously about the creature's unusual means of reproduction. Although rumors have long prevailed about the existence of zombies created as a byproduct of the chrysalid gestation, recent reports seem to indicate a new, equally disturbing means of propagating their species. Alright. Uh, let's take a quick look at build items, weapons. Uh, that requires five alloys. Oh. Oh, and now I don't have access to the robot upgrades because I don't have a robot because I got my robot killed. No, no! And I assume that uh, the serpent suit also needs five alloys. Yeah, it, it can never be easy, can it? Oh well, we should have access to those things soon enough, I believe. So that should be fine. And I have the supplies direct to whenever we do get stuff like that. And let's go to the black market, sure. Let's see if they have any alloys. They might do, and I do have some intel that I could use for that purpose. I still haven't started the codex or anything like that. 41 allo alloys, yes, I will take those alloys, thank you. Superior, superior, oh, 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 yes, these are all very, very nice. But, do I care? Yeah. We're done here. Oh now, what did I want? What did I really, really want? <gasps> I can do the things now. Yes, I have the alloys. Engineering, Commander. brewing ground. We are gonna make the suits. We are going to make the serpent suit. Excellent. And we're going to make the Iker's armor. Excellent. Oh, is the Iker's armor not upgradable? New orders, Commander. Is that does that already come at the maximum? Oh, now we need lyrium. 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 Yes, uh, let's get some Illyrium as well then. I guess our intel is getting some use. How much Illyrium do you have? I'll take it all. Oh, did you have a scientist? No, that's an engineer. Never mind. Uh, I was hoping there for a moment. I'm not sure how much a scientist would help me at this point, but... I don't think it would hurt. There we go, those are now nice and upgraded. And between the sessions, between the weeks, I will also make sure that uh, those are properly customized for every soldier that I have named. And I will have to recustomize the meat suit as well, because apparently that didn't want to stay customized. Uh, what do we want? Intel? Yeah, let's get the Intel. 15. West Asia. I am building something right now, theoretically, but that doesn't really matter, now does it? Now okay, let's take a look. We can now have automated defenses. Lots of fucking good that'll do us, eh? Facility upgraded. Sure, let's have more turrets. The more, the merrier. And I think I'm pretty much back in the same stage as I was before. Ooh. 
Supplies and the intel. Uh, sure. Let's do that. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time when we go and get that. What was I trying to say before that? Who knows? Because I certainly don't. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I'll just out.